Hallo und willkommen zu einer neuen Folge von The Council. So, wir sind in der letzten Folge wieder richtig scheiße vorangekommen, denn wir verlieren jede Konfrontation. Das ist natürlich sehr schön, darüber freut sich die Clara nicht, aber ähm, sie ist einfach blöd. So, ich bin jetzt letzte Folge einfach noch hierher gelaufen und wir befinden uns jetzt... Golden Elixir. Consume without access. Okay, äh, wir sind jetzt hier in der Bibliothek, müssen wir jetzt sein und erkunden jetzt das hier alles weiter. Ähm, ich bin vom kleinen Salon jetzt hierher gelaufen und ich habe hier noch irgendwie was Kleines gefunden, aber es war irgendwie so ein Goldelixier oder irgendwie sowas. Ähm, ich wollte die Notizen haben. Okay. Ist natürlich cool, wenn wir hier diese, diese drei Dings finden. Äh, dann... Atreus, the Miller brothers. Mother expressly forbade me from reading it. Okay. Honey, I couldn't have hoped for better. Ich glaube, das ist einfach honigsüchtig. Ich weiß auch gar nicht, ob das vielleicht zu der Zeit auch ziemlich teuer war oder alles. Kann ich mir halt vorstellen. A few pages out of an old encyclopedia. Ah, okay, hier haben wir jetzt den zweiten. Ah, Sammlermünze. Ich glaube, eine Sammlermünze habe ich da vorne schon gefunden. Ähm so. Wow. Das kann nicht echt sein. size you up. Chances are, that's the room my mother spoke of. And she also spoke of a Medusa. Should I go and try to find the creature now? Okay, then we'll first go in the room. So we have the room. Liberty or Death by Renyo. Well, I'll take Liberty, please. Okay. But well, I do understand his choice, even though it seems radical. Allegory regarding the Declaration of the Rights of Men. That's the least you could say. Celia. That name means nothing to me. Sagt er jetzt noch nichts? Sorry. Ist auch nicht so Kunst gemeint. Ah, painting by Ingres. Molière, dining with Louis XIV. The king's posture is surprising. It's almost as if he's addressing someone in the assembly. Schön, dass du die zwölf so wunderschön ausgesprochen hast. Nämlich Französisch. Ich muss sagen, diese, diese Slideshow, sagen wir mal so, durch den Raum sieht schon echt sehr gut. Ähm, gefallen mir auch mal wirklich sehr. Ich bin aber natürlich auf der Suche nach Gold Elixir. Was war das zweite jetzt? Habe ich ihn da jetzt hier sehen? Das war. Okay. Ähm, ich würde jetzt nicht jedes Bild angucken, sorry, aber. Äh, ja, das, nee, das nervt mich. The Song of Roland. Roland feeleth his death is near, his brain is oozing by either ear. With his brain oozing, it's already remarkable that he can feel anything. Sorry, das möchte ich aber bitte. Christ crucified by Velasquez. Look. Someone's left a note there. Reserved for the Duke of Alquidia. Okay. Das könnte vielleicht mal relevant werden, deswegen habe ich es mal angeschaut. So, wir haben jetzt hier irgendwie was komisches. Oh, das war die Medusa. Na, ich will mich trotzdem hier nochmal umschauen. Hm. Aber keine Zeit. Ähm. Also Zeit, ja, es wäre jetzt kein Akt, dieses Schloss zu knacken. Ja, ich wusste, da komme ich nicht mit meiner Gewandtheit ran. Was sind das für ein Typ? Lämpchen. Pferd. Medusa. I've got to find out what Mother was trying to do with her. 
the Medusa. A hero armed with a sword? Hmm. A hero with a lantern. And the last one holding a shield. I'll stake my life on it. All the statues form a single scene together. The poor devils are about to face the beast. Let's give them a helping hand. Ich glaube, ich kann mich daran erinnern, wie es war. Ähm ähm Hier müsste okay stehen. Hier auch. Ich weiß es nicht, ob es stimmt. Schattel drehen. Zu dem Typ mit dem Schild. Nein, gut. <lacht> Weil ich hatte mir gedacht, oder? Moment, neben der Laterne. Nein. Ähm, ich hatte gedacht, dass es so ist. Dem Schild, dem Schwert mit der Laterne. Mal, ich hole mal die. The clue I found said, Beware Hero. The beast always charges the best protected. That is its weakness. That's the key. The best protected hero is the one holding the shield. Thank you, Mother. Moment. The clue I found said, Beware Hero. The beast always charges the best protected. That is its weakness. That's the key. The best protected hero is the one holding the shield. Thank you, mother. Um, also meines Erachtens schaut der halt zu dem Held mit dem Schild. So, aber wohin schaut der? Können wir den zu dem Held mit dem Schwert drehen? Also ich hatte halt gedacht, okay, ähm, dass wir Medusa selbst blenden sozusagen. Was ist denn das hier? The origin of myths, a reinterpretation of legendary creatures. Just what I need. The text is in French on the left hand page and in Latin on the right hand. Let's find the chapter on the Medusa. Um, ich kann den französischen Text lesen. Hang on. This version is significantly different from the regular one. It recounts how men have always belittled women in society. Harpies, mermaids, the chimera, the hydra, the gorgons. Ah, the section on the Medusa. While some of the heroes divert attention from the gorgon, the hero with the sword brandishes his weapon at the Medusa. Also, das habe ich auch. Nochmal. Hang on. This version is significantly different from the regular one. It recounts how men have always belittled women in society. Harpies, mermaids, the chimera, the hydra, the gorgons. Ah, the section on the Medusa. While some of the heroes divert attention from the gorgon, the hero with the sword brandishes his weapon at the Medusa. Okay, der mit dem Schwert ist auf jeden Fall auf sie. Aber ich weiß halt nicht... Was der, der Typ da hinten macht. Also es ist schon mal klar. Er ist auf die Medusa. Und er schaut meines Erachtens nicht unbedingt die Tante an. Ich weiß es nicht so genau. Habe ich da gerade irgendwas gehört? The clue I found said, Beware hero. The beast always charges the best protected. That is its weakness. That's the key. The best protected hero is the one holding the shield. Thank you, mother. Also, ich verstehe es so. Ähm, Medusa schaut natürlich den Typ an, der als bestes 
ähm, sozusagen geschützt ist. Aber er hat sich abgewendet. Deswegen schaut er meiner Meinung nach zu dem Typen mit der Laterne. So, er richtet auf jeden Fall das Schwert auf Medusa. Genau, zu Medusa. Das macht Sinn. Ähm, doch was macht der Typ? Der einfach gar nicht... Was machst du? It looks right, but nothing's happening. Maybe in this position, the hero with the shield is just dazzling his colleague. If I respect the legend, I have to place the hero holding the shield in front of the Medusa. Except for here, it doesn't work. There must be something else. Sake, Emily, you scared the pants off me. Don't ever do that again. Well, keep your nose out of my business then. I don't know what you're talking about. Stop fooling around and tell me what you're doing here. Wait a moment. 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 Wait a ähm, oder ne, es war ja nichts im Kreis. Wir uns in Aufraten sind, was wir hier suchen. Ehrlich, Antworten... Ich glaube ja eigentlich schon. I've discovered a hidden message from my mother. She explains how to find the secret room. Something must have attracted her here, so I've come to check it out. And you? What brings you here? Ma, you're curious. Let me guess. Go on then, impress me. Sie, su ähm, zu einem Sie sucht jemanden einen Witz machen. Sie stellt Nachfolge, Nachforschung über Montier an. Ähm Was könnte sie hier suchen? Ich glaube nicht, dass sie jemanden sucht. You're spying on Mortimer, right? Everyone is spying on Mortimer. Shall I take that for a yes? Take it as you please, but I wouldn't be surprised if all the guests were around here somewhere searching the manor. Well, no matter. I'll tolerate your presence this one time. Now, since you're here, make yourself useful. Look around on your side. I'll do the same on mine. And if you find anything of interest, let me know. Oh yeah, in your dreams. At your service, madam. Ich weiß nicht, ob ich schon angesprochen habe, aber dieses Kleid ist so unlogisch. Erstens, ihre Brüste sehen aus, wie ob sie komplett gemacht sind. Zweitens, wie zur Hölle soll dieses Kleid halten? Wenn es nicht mal hinten irgendwie geschnürt ist. Es ist unlogisch, dieses Kleid. Aber okay. Inschrift lesen, Symbole untersuchen. Ich habe einen amazing Ring gefunden. Es gibt eine Inscription engraved on it. You're married. Why don't you wear a wedding ring? You mean wear something just to prove your love, not my style. Okay. A golden fleece. It's freezing. Hurry up. I must erraten, das Fleece zu benutzen. Ist das Golden Fleece? 
cold? You want a rug? It'll warm you up. I wouldn't be caught dead in that horrible thing. <laughs> That's a pity. The gold color brings out your eyes. And your flattery brings out your boorishness. Sorry. Ich hab gedacht, ich bin lustig, aber... An unofficial gospel? You'd be more likely to find this kind of book at the Vatican. Nothing special. The library at Buckingham has three. I bet you've read them cover to cover. Naturally. Really? I'm curious. Tell me, what part stood out the most to you? The passage where Mary says to Joseph, Hey, you, shut up. In other words, you haven't even opened one. Oh, ich glaube, wir machen uns gerade sehr unbeliebt bei ihr. Hey, Mortimer is the author of this work. He talks about his passion for art. Oh, das war eine Sammlermünze. Okay. Ich glaube, wenn jetzt noch irgendwas kommt, dann halte ich mal die Fresse. Guess what I found? The Holy Grail. Older than that. A piece of Noah's Ark. Not that old. This could go on for hours. Just tell me. Caesar's laurel wreath. Es ist besser, wenn ich jetzt nichts mehr sage. Ich glaube, sie ist so schon so genervt von uns. Sie denkt immer nur so. Well, looks like a pamphlet on. Nice gefunden. Political regimes, written by Mortimer himself. Ich glaube, es ist am Ende. You should see the sword, Emily. It's magnificent. I'm busy. Describe it to me. A fragment of amber. Oh shit, ich konnte es auf der anderen Seite. something interesting. A manor in Maine. Hundreds of acres of land in Catalonia. Properties in Shanghai. Incredible. Some of these deeds are over 600 years old. And all signed by the hand of Mortimer. I wonder if that's what inspired my mother's attention. How come all these documents have Mortimer's signature on them? Do you think all these properties really belong to him? See those fine scratches around the words? Yes, and? The ink barely spreads on the paper. It spreads exactly the same way on the signature. The deed was written using the same ink. If it is a fake, then it's a professional job. These documents must be fakes. No man can own that many original works, no matter how rich he is. Be careful. The Order has tried many times to estimate his personal wealth without ever succeeding. And look here. Castles in Scotland, vineyards in Italy, districts in Venice. He's richer than some European countries. These documents are intriguing, but do you really think that's what attracted your mother's attention here? I don't know. She was obsessed with Mortimer, and I must confess, these property deeds are troubling. If that's the case, why would she have left them? Once again, I don't know. We'll have to ask her when we find her. And what's your take? What sagt sie zu dieser Sammlung, woher stammt das alles? Warum die Sammlung verstecken? Mortimer's collection is unique, isn't it? That's an understatement. No doubt he has a major passion for history and fine art, or getting gifts. If each time Mortimer does someone a favor, they reward him with a priceless gift. That means he must have helped nearly everybody in the world. I wonder why my mother didn't make it clear what she was interested in here. She didn't have time to write it down, or maybe she wasn't sure of what she was looking for. Or she wanted to protect her discoveries. It's disturbing. You'll just have to search the rest of the room. Maybe you'll find something. Okay. Good. Then find we vielleicht was. We have everything we have looked at. Let's go back. Zurück. Also wir haben zumindest jetzt ein bisschen 
besser gestimmt. Ähm, ich vermute, es ist jetzt dieses kleine. What is that you found? A cameo pendant. What's going on? Nothing. For crying out loud, Emily, you lunge for that jewel like your life depended on it. Tell me what this is about. No. We just met, Louis. I like you, but I can't just suddenly open myself up like a book to you. Listen, Emily. It seems pretty obvious to me that you haven't come here for the sole purpose of sampling Mortimer's cellar. Stop all the clever evasions and just trust me. And why the hell should I place my trust in you, Louis? Uh, weil ich ihr vertraue. Moment. Moment. Ich gucke jetzt aber ganz schnell ab. Ach. Ähm, uns fehlen nur noch drei Charaktere. Wo ist sie denn? Äh, Schwäche ist Psychologie. Psychologie? Psychologie. When are you going to understand that I just want to help you? What do you expect? That I'll fall into your arms and say yes to everything you want? What are you talking about? I'm only asking you to trust me a little. If only on principle, as a member of the Golden Order, for example. I'll admit you are fairly reliable. That's it? I was expecting more. Well, I'm prepared to trust you when it comes to choosing a French cheese. But I've nothing to gain by confiding in you any further than that. Nothing to gain? Damn it, Emily! I'm only trying to help you. Stop needing to gain something all the time. Because you think I need help. Just like everyone. You have your strengths and your weaknesses. And there's no use pretending otherwise. Ha! And I bet you found out where I'm weak, haven't you? Oh Gott, eine Schwäche in Psychologie. Schwäche in Befragung. Frauen, Sie haben erkannt. Ähm, dann würde ich mal sagen, dass ich hier... Als ich ins Gesicht sage, dass er eine Schwäche in Psychologie hat. You think your scathing wit protects you, but in fact it makes you blind. No sooner have people introduce themselves and you already see them in a bad light. You play the part of a strong woman and yes, you are a strong woman of course. But what I see is a sensitive young lady who lacks self-confidence. Stop adopting a defensive posture and you'll see just how quickly new doors will open. There is some truth to what you say. I might have some weaknesses, but I don't need your help to overcome them. And I'm simply not contemplating collaborating with anyone at this time. Do you understand? Sie arbeitet lieber alleine. Sie hat einen Auftrag. Sie arbeitet für jemanden. Sie hat bereits einen Partner. Yes, it's perfectly clear. You're already working with someone. Ah, well spotted, Louis. I already have a work partner. I know my weaknesses. I don't doubt that your abilities will be of use to me. But I already have all that, thanks to my teammate. Is there any chance you might tell me who he is? Mm, no, I've already said too much. Consider yourself lucky I've even given you this much. It's extremely rare, believe me. Come on, don't stop now that you've come this far. You know that eventually I'll end up making you talk. Well, since no one can resist you, let's see if you can guess who my partner is. You're a gambler. So, your partner is... Um, von der Brusche her denke ich eine Frau. Ähm, sagen wir so. Das Problem ist, dass ich weiß dass es ihre Schwester ist. Weil ich es halt noch durchs Let's Play kenne. Your sister. She's your partner. She's the one you're looking for. Well, I am impressed. How the devil did you guess I had a sister? Virtually no one even knows. When it comes to getting results, you are very good. I grant you that. You deserve to know why the sight of the cameo pendant affected me so strongly. I thought it belonged to Emma, my twin sister. Oh, now I get why you said you had a memory for two. Yes, you can't imagine to what extent though. As children, everyone got us mixed up. So one day we decided to play along. 
Since then, we have become one and the same. We have officially erased the identity of my sister Emma. Emily Hillsborough. The woman with two faces. Clever. But isn't it complicated? How do you make it work? One of us has no existence in the outside world. We share everything. First for one, then for the other. We dress the same, wear the same makeup, we speak the same. We've learned to act as one. When we accept a mission, we both turn up. This time, though, she went ahead, and I was meant to wait for her on the mainland. She was meant to meet Sir Home and bring back the details so we could work out who would follow up. And there was a problem? She was supposed to return for Mortimer's one week ago. The boat turned up at Plymouth, but alas, no trace of my sister. Instead, a sailor passed me a message from home, notifying me of her sudden disappearance. So, my mother and your sister go missing just a few days apart. That's strange. Maybe their disappearances are linked. It's clearly a possibility, but up to now I haven't found a trace of either of them. None of this is very reassuring. By the way, Louis, now that you are in on the secret, you are obliged to keep it to yourself. Or you will pay very dearly. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. It's time to leave. Oh my god, ich habe die Konfrontation gewonnen. Das nenne ich geil. So, what do you think of our first adventure? I must admit it has been fun by your side. Same here. She's been drinking too much again. Louis, I need to talk to you right now. Good evening. Das machen wir erst in einer neuen Folge. Bis dahin wünsche ich euch einen wundervollen Tag und ich bedanke mich fürs Zuschauen. Tschüss.